Hi guys and welcome to my channel place. Also today's video is an old school kind of a video. So basically I'm gonna wear my makeup in front of this camera. I used to love doing all the videos but right now uh, like I have fallen out of that phase like wearing a lot of makeup on my face and I love the way I wear my makeup nowadays. It's totally minimalistic. Today I'm going to give you the updated makeup routine of mine and also one more thing is that everyone is staying home at this moment, uh, me too. I am working from home, I am in home at this moment, I came to my hometown right now and almost everyone is working from home still uh, like slowly offices are opening up definitely but it's better to be at home than to be outside. So yeah, I just wanted to show what I wear when I am in home. So yeah, let us begin instead of rambling. Yes. So first of all, you I think you can see my puffiness in my eyes. I just woke up. So basically, it's a realistic makeup. I will say it's a realistic makeup look because I have currently like it's just been an hour that I have just woke up and. I still have got the puffy eyes and still I have got the puffy eyes, puffy face from my morning. Yeah, so let's just begin. First of all, I just wanted to uh, make sure is that my face is clean and moisturized. So it's definitely, uh, I have cleaned my face. I use the uh, WOW like Wow Sciences Apple Cider Vinegar Face Wash, Foaming Face Wash and I've used a L'Oreal Paris Moisturizer like the morning one and I am I, I feel moisturized and clean my, like the base is clean to put on the makeup yes so the first one because as I mentioned I am not wearing a tons of makeup nowadays it's totally minimalistic and definitely if you are in home it's fine if you skip the um I will say sunscreen or foundation it's totally fine to do that so today I will just wear a little bit of uh, concealer so it's from L'Oreal Paris I've used it so much that it, the name has been scrapped away you can see that I have used it so so much so I'll just use this concealer right now if you want you can definitely use a like BB cream or CC cream that will give you a little bit of coverage so I usually use the Pons uh, BB, BB Plus cream, but you can use anyone you have at home. But today I'm gonna just use my concealer out and I'm gonna conceal some of the area and definitely I have to hide my puffy eyes. I'll do the first. I'll do that first. So also guys, <clears throat> so also guys, whoever is watching this uh, video. Just let me know if I have started going to uh, parlors or not, like salons or not because still I am doing my threading or I am just uh, cleaning my face, like deep cleansing my face by myself in home and I think I have, I am doing quite a good of job of this thing but if you guys have started to go to the salons, just let me know in the comments down below. So guys, now if you want, definitely you can go and set up your face if you have got a super oily skin with some setting powder. But I think I'm good to go because if I use a little bit of setting powder also, I think my face will go more dry. Like it will look dry in this camera. So the next product that I am like religiously using is this bronzer. So this is from the My Glam Pose HD Bronzer Duo. I really love this one. I, first of all, I just wanted to talk about the packaging. It's a, I will say, it's a cruelty-free packaging. It's not a plastic packaging at all. It's a cardboard packaging, so definitely it will decompose sooner than the plastic ones. And also, I really love this shade. This goes totally fine with my face. Like, it actually matches my skin tone, and I really love this. Also, this bronzer feels like it totally blends with my face. So yeah, so let's just blend it out. Also, just wanted to mention one more thing. It's not necessary to wear a bronzer every day. 
but I love to highlight my face so I definitely sometimes I definitely skip this step so the next step that I follow is my favorite step, step and I don't skip this one at all is this brow pencil so basically I just love to highlight my brows because it's not that thick enough and when I trade it it definitely looks so worse like it looks like I don't have a eyebrow so definitely I have to draw my eyebrows so yeah And also I just wanted to mention one thing I use when I am staying at home like working from home and all I don't draw for fragile I just fill up the ball spot that I have a uh, ball spot that I have got on my brows I always tend to go overboard with my eyebrows is this thing that I do I think the brow pencil that I'm using it's not suitable for my skin tone but I just have paid a lot of money for that and I want to use it up so yeah and also a lot of color changing is going on on my video it's only because it's a very much grayish day today and yeah is this sun I can't blame myself is this sun yeah um so the next one that I want to do because I wear glasses I wear glasses I am not a fan of wearing contact lens I definitely can wear it out but the thing is that it irritates my eyes so I don't wear contact lenses and I wear glasses so definitely my eyes tend to look like it don't exist at all because I have got a very uh, I have got a huge power so it feels like I have got no eyes and as you know I just woke up and my eyes are feeling puffy it's looking puffy so I have to do something to hide that out so I will just use this uh, plum color gel and I am falling have I have just fallen in love with it I'm just gonna highlight my eyes I will do just nothing more I will just highlight my eye and just will put up some uh, like shadowy kind of thing on my eyelids just wanted to let you guys is that if you're wearing glasses this is the right way to wear a kajal or liner because it definitely will highlight your eyes and if you're wearing a glasses it will definitely highlight through that and if you have a lot of power definitely to highlight so yeah so this is all that i usually wear on everyday basis definitely you can wear some light color lipstick for the day because you'll be in the home but I tend to again skip it, uh, skip that up. I usually don't wear anything on my lips. If I'm wearing something, it will be definitely a lip balm or um, lip oil treatment, uh, not more than that. Because I've got some dark beige patches on my lips, I really wanted to lighten that up. But other than that, I don't use anything on my lips if I'm staying in home. And as I have mentioned, I'm working from home. I, I'm hardly going outside. So yeah. This is all that I love to wear on everyday basis and as, you mentioned, as I have mentioned in the video is it, it is a get ready with me video so definitely I'm gonna show what I am doing with my hair so basically I'm done I am doing nothing because I have came hometown I came to my hometown and where I am like my hometown is it's really hot over here you will sweat throughout the day and that's the reason I don't want my hair on my face first of all I have got a very long hair my hair length is very very long and I don't want my sweaty hairs on my face so basically I'm just doing nothing I'm gonna basically I'm just doing nothing I'm just gonna tie a bun and I'm just gonna secure it with a, just a clutcher or a hair band that's all for my hair so yeah this is all that i'm putting on my face on daily basis and this is my go-to makeup for the moment and go to look for the moment and i hope that you all have enjoyed this video i hope that you have uh, loved the products that i have used to put on my face in this video and i hope that it has inspired you to at least put yourself up uh, in some I will say better position if you're staying at home and working from home because uh, if you feel a 
if you put a little bit of makeup also on your face it will definitely boost you up to do something because staying at home has definitely has been affected a lot of uh, people with, with their mental issues it has affected with me also that's the reason I have to fly back to my hometown because it was killing me over there alone so if you put a little bit of makeup also it will definitely at least boost you up to do something for the day at least boost you up to be happy for the day so yeah don't worry put some makeup on your face and start working so yeah and don't forget to support this channel by clicking the subscribe button it's totally free to do and also when you subscribe to my channel it definitely motivates me to film more videos and also when you subscribe to my channel it definitely motivates me to film more videos and come up with some new ideas it also improves my creativity and also it makes me learn more editing things which has really helped me a lot because I've learned a lot so yeah don't forget to subscribe it's just free click that button right now and also I will see you all in the next video till then you all guys stay beautiful stay at home stay safe take care of your mental health bye um, I, at least a casual I hardly wear it